All right, today I'm going to do a quick teardown of a Rod Piezo. Uh, Piezo pickup for, this one's for a cigar box guitar. Um, often they're a little round disc. This one's a little different shaped. Um, so I thought I'd see what it was made of. So if you look at it this way, again, you can see there's six little bumps, presumably for the six strings. Um, and I believe each one of those is a small individual piezo. So we're going to cut this apart and see what's inside. All right, so far we got a little uh, copper strip running over the top and a little metal U-channel in the bottom. So I'm comfortable cutting along that. It's hard to tell, but right in here there's a gap. So this, these are ceramic piezos right there. A little gap in between. This copper bar connects all six. And this is the ground on this side connecting all six. Um, all right, let's see what else we can do. All right, looks like that copper bar actually is just pressing on the top of that. So that's how that's making contact. So uh, it is connected on the end right here. It's actually soldered at the end there and soldered at the end on this side. All right, we're going to cut this end. So that copper bar might be the ground. Um, if, you, if you can see inside here, there's actually a little thin piece of what's presumably insulated material. So this copper bar and this outside shield are all one. And then there's another either ground or positive down in there. Oh. That popped right out. All right. So this this part's a little flexible. It actually looks like it's just a piece of masking tape, which is what they're using to insulate it. All right, and those little piezos are just taped in there. So that's that's the piezo. There's a red line on this side. Nothing on that side. A little maybe a gray line. But, so that's probably positive, and that's negative. A little piezo bar right there. I think this is like six bucks on Amazon. So there's six piezos in there. So clearly this could easily be cut at any point. If you wanted to use fewer, you'd have to be you know, careful not to mash it up. Make sure that your outside bar at the end isn't touching the copper. Or you might be able to use these piezos separate in something else. At the other end, we've got a very super th slim Eighth inch jack. Just 
soldered right to the outside and to the pin in the middle there. This side and bottom. Bottom bar goes to the pin in the middle. And the copper on the south side shield is the ground. So I think that about does it. That's the inside of a rod PZO pickup.